Good day, YouTube. This is just a bit of a quick unscripted uh, review between KDE Neon on the left and Deepin Linux 20.1 uh, on the right. So grab your stein of coffee and let's get started. Okay, so we've got KDE Neon on the left here and then uh, just making things a little bit neater, but we've got Deepin Linux on the right here. So they are very different in nature, a bit of an apples to oranges uh, video comparison. But uh, getting started, uh, now we have KDE Neon on the left based on Ubuntu, uh, long-term service release 20.04. Then we've got the uh, Deepin Linux, which previously was actually based on Ubuntu, but is now based on uh, on Debian there, kind of similar to its own name. Now some of the key differences is in the, the actual desktop environment. We've got the KDE Plasma desktop environment, which many people love there on the left for KDE Neon. And on the right hand side, we've got this this uh, this this in-house built Deepin desktop environment or DDE they sometimes call it there, which is really nice, a little bit uh, Mac OS-esque in the way that it works, very beautiful indeed. But uh, that's uh, enough about that one there. Let's go to the file managers, and they look uh, nice and pretty enough. In fact, really, really beautiful design on the deep inside of things. So I'm very, very quite proud of what I can see there. Uh, if we were to move across to the kernels, we will find that they are quite similar in nature. Very stable kernels there. 5.4, not the latest and greatest indeed, but uh, stable by all accounts, I'm sure, 5.4 as well. Uh, if we were to, uh, they are actually both point releases, of course, so they're not rolling releases by any means, so you won't have the latest and greatest stuff there sometimes. But last but not least, uh, being a quick video, let's just chuck in some details. And wow, I really love what they've done with the terminal here. In fact, everything, it just it just works. It looks really, really great. Uh, jump across to the terminal and have a look, and we can see, yep, CPU, that's okay. Or is it? Was it? No, that's okay. Oh, look, using exactly the, the amount of RAM, same amount of RAM, until it chimed down on this side. So both about 530 megabytes of RAM straight off of the, off the bat on boot up. Nothing really booted up in the background. So yeah, very very low in RAM usage, which is nice to see. Uh, nice to very nice to see. You know, depending on if, if you are going to be uh, needing to keep that in mind for using it on older hardware. But I'm very very uh, pleased with the Deepin. Probably a few more skins and things you can use for sure, but it looks very beautiful out of the box. Combination of Windows, the best of, uh, really they say it's a friendly operating system that's that's really uh, the best of all worlds there. But um, I'll leave it at that there for now, guys. Probably Deepin needs a whole video of its own, but thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see you guys there in the next one. Ciao.